Drones are becoming a bigger part of the market here at ISE. I am at the Drone Arena here at ISE 2024 with Laszlo from Lang. It's great to be with you here today. Tell me about the drone market here at ISE. What are we seeing? What trends are we seeing? Why is it all taking off? Pleasure is. Since we introduced drones in the last year at the Lang booth, we realized that there is a lot of drone technology out there, but it's really a high step of investment and a high step of learning to get into the drone market. So we as Lang decided we need to be an enabler. With our Lang Academy, we have our educational programs and with our Lang way of purchasing and finding new products, we have a great chance of finding products which we find viable for the event market and to give our customers the abilities and the skill sets to easily go into the drone market. No company wants to introduce or to buy a thousand drones without any experience in doing drone shows. So with our approach, they can get their baby steps in with us taking them by the hand and then if they're going to on the big stage and having big shows, we are able to provide the support in material and personnel if needed, they desire. Absolutely. And as you can see, we've got a great display going on here. What's been happening at the Drone Arena? What can people see here? Correct. Currently, this is a product demonstration of the new Verge drone, the X7, which uh, Lang is, we're cooperating with, with Verge. Other points are, for example, Flock Drone Shows is flying an indoor drone show with 30 drones in here. There will be one in the morning, one in the evening, and a few other companies will exhibit and give talks here. Me, myself, I'll give a short introduction on drones in the event industry and how to get into the event industry and drones in the morning. That's basically why we decided to just step up our drone game from last year, this year, in cooperation with ISE to establish it more in the AV market and in the visual presentation sector. Yes, absolutely. And you've had lots of interest here at the Drone Arena. There is, it's a burgeoning market. It is starting to mature slowly but surely. Um, how can event technology companies really maximize their use of drones? What should they be doing? They, at first, they shouldn't be taken aback by the laws and regulations. There is some upfront cost in work you have to do to get your permits, but once you've understood the process, it's really just knowing how to play bureaucracy. After that, the important part is to get the idea of what to do with drones. It's not just a big LED screen with the variables pixel pitch. They can move in three dimensions and you have a whole different area you usually not use, which is right above your projection mapping, your stage, your arena, you name it, or even indoor in your theater. So to get the basic idea of what you can do, we, for example, did a relay race drone show at our company headquarters for an event to have our company logo hover in the air for 90 minutes with interchanging drone swarms and ground crews rolling through the drone swarms, which is another application in uh, advertisement and marketing. There are endless possibilities. Everything that's hindering the market right now is the will to get into the ideation of what you can do. Don't take me back by the laws. First have an idea and then find a location where you can try to get your baby steps in. Don't do a thousand drone show, do a simple, simple drone show. Get some drones, learn how to fly them and understand the process and trust the process. Absolutely. Well, it seems that Lang's certainly creating a buzz here at the Drone Show Arena and I look forward to seeing this market flying high. Thank you very much, Laszlo. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Thank you.